G'day guys, this is Booze Review the Show, but we review the booze. So today I'll be reviewing a newly re-released Australian modern classic. We have Tui's Extra Dry Platinum. There it is guys, newly released. Hard to find, I somehow managed to accidentally come across it. Yeah, I got a slab immediately. So this one here is 6.5% ABV and this rather nice decorative 330ml black can. Right there, I feel like a Tui's. Yeah, so if you guys didn't know, this was released in 2006. It was then discontinued in 2011, sort of around there, 2011, 2012. Um, so I never got to try it back in the day, unfortunately. That was kind of just when I was starting to drink. So yeah, unfortunately never got to try it back in the day. They had it in bottles and in eight packs, I believe. Um, but yeah, this is one that uh, pretty much most you know people over the age of 30 were trying back in the day and were loving it. So yeah, it's basically a strong beer, 6.5%. And uh, yeah, let's do it, guys. This is the first review on YouTube featuring the newly released to his new platinum jez did a couple of reviews back on the day you know back in the day uh around 2011 2010 he reviewed them but yeah i haven't seen any reviews of this one yet the newly released stuff so yeah let's uh give it a crack and give it a pour shall we apparently it's the same recipe um so yeah it's good to see let's pour into the classic beer glass like that very foamy whoa not my best pour. There we go. Wow. What a crappy pour for an epic video. <laughs> right off the bat there, guys, we have several centimetres, probably about 10 centimetres of bright white head. Strong, sweet malt smell. Definitely very clear. You can see it there. No cloudiness. Definitely very effervescent. Probably a low amount of carbonation there. Very few bubbles. Don't know if you can see that. But yeah, kind of just looks like typical lager, as I said with the aroma. You don't really detect that much, really, for what it is. It doesn't really have much of a smell. Yeah, kind of just smells like a regular lager, really. Who would know that it's 6.5%? Anyway, guys, I think it's high time that I give Tui's Extra Dry Platinum a little taste. Cheers, cheers. That's the thumbnail right there. Cheers. Ah. Definitely get a nice sweet malt hit immediately there, guys. It's bold. It's brash. It's unapologetic. It's really good. It's just in your face. It's good stuff. Little to no bitterness, whatever bitterness there is, is just for balance, really. But yeah, think of it as like an Australian strong lager or an Aussie malt liquor, really. This is what this is. Yeah, good stuff. Good stuff. High time that uh, the style is, you know, represented in Australia. We had the VBVX a few months ago, which wasn't really executed that well, you know, in the stubby little bottles and the four pack, but... Yeah, they sell this in six packs and slabs, so that's they're doing it right, you know what I mean? Let's go for another sip, shall we? Ah, uh, yeah, good stuff. So this is very, as of the shooting of this video, it is very newly released. Um, I believe uh, they're doing it in New South Wales first, and then it's going to be in Queensland later the month, but I kind of just assumed that I wouldn't be getting any sort of really, like sort of this weekend or anything like that, but I happened to just sort of go to the local bottle shop near my work, and I kind of just was looking at sort of, you know, what I'm going to get or whatever, and I looked down, I just see these big black sort of, you know, case like slabs of Tui's, and I'm sort of just looking at it going, no way. Yeah, guys, here it is, Tui's Platinum, awesome. So it was around 26 bucks for a six pack, Decent priced, uh, it was around $70 for a slab, which is, for a strong lager, is decently priced as well. So, Toys is uh, doing a good, good job with the strong lagers, in my opinion. Good job, Toys, Pulling it off well. I can see this sticking around. Maybe even it'll be, you know, permanent from now on. Hopefully, they don't take it away from us like they did last time. So, anyway, guys, I think it is high time. I'm going to give Toys Extra Dry Platinum a final sip and a final score.
Cheers to you guys. We're getting close to 1,000 subscribers. If you haven't subscribed, do it now. Get me to 1,000 subs. And uh, yeah, let's go again, shall we? Final sip. I might as well finish that off. Delicious. It's strong, multi, well-balanced, smooth. It's just really good. It's, it's a nice, just crisp, strong lager. Really smooth, goes down well, especially on a hot day. It is starting to warm up, again, out of winter. But yeah, overall, for what it is, I have to give Tui's Extra Dry Platinum a solid 9 out of 10, guys. It's good stuff. Highly recommended. Give it a go if you see it. I'm sure you're going to be seeing it around um, from now on, hopefully. But yeah, it's good stuff, guys. I certainly did feel like a Tui's. <laughs> anyway, cheers, cheers, guys. If you liked that video, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, do whatever you want. And uh, yeah, I'll see you next time. Cheers, cheers.